Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook. Andrew McCart, IFL TV. Um, Sam Jones, you only came backstage to do a pee, but uh, yeah. you've had it out with Sonny. Yeah. I mean, you're going to have it out in a minute over this Josh Taylor-Jack Carroll fight. I mean, yeah. you're a wanted man. Yeah, it's just, listen, it's good to be it's good to be wanted. But no, not long now, six weeks today, then we're going to finally get a, uh, uh, a, uh, the real winner. The real winner. The real winner. Well, let's talk about Josh Taylor-Jack Carroll. You, um, say, you, you still deny watching that fight. You're such full of shit you are. I, I swear... I, I was s- in the birthing room. I was in the birthing room. I didn't watch the feet. I didn't watch the feet. I've not watched it. You have watched it. You're lying. You're telling pork pies. You watch the fight. You watch Jack beat him. He'll beat him again. I swear I've not watched that fight. I promise you right now. I have not. I'm going to watch it before this one on May 27th. So I will watch it. May 25th, sorry. Yes, May 25th. No, if, I turn, if I turn up on the 27th, then I've missed it. And I will not watch it again. Yeah, it's, listen. Oh, did, did Rihanna Dixon win? Yes. Wicked. Yes. Stop it. No. Uh, points. Um, you, you, I phoned you midweek, Wednesday. Yes. Um, you were in the gym with Jack Sparn and your words to me... Sparring, no, but yeah, no, you were... You let stick there, Andy. No, I was watching Jack yeah, Sparn. I said. You yeah, were watching Sparn. Yeah. yeah. And what your words to me was? He, he, he was he was terrific. Absolutely. He's gonna what to my boy? Light him up like Chinese New Year. <laughs> you don't like, you, you seem confident in a way that you don't see this as a 50-50 fight. You know, court, listen, you, you don't try and get me into trouble for your little clicks. Josh Taylor's a brilliant fighter. We've said this before. It's a great fight, and this is the reason why everyone's interested in it. It's a 50-50 fight, but we believe Jack's gonna win. And you with with this Josh Taylor, like you know yourself, like he's he, Josh has openly admitted that, that he looked past Jack in the first yeah. fight and he was looking beyond it. And he's going to say that. But Josh. again, yeah, he's going to say that. He is going to say that. Of course, of course, of course, he's going to say that. The fight I didn't watch, and I'll probably watch it tonight because you're pissing me off. <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah. Um, but he's admitted that. Be, and plus, if you look at the, po- the, the the fight week interviews, everything was Terence Crawford and Earl Spence for Josh, and everything was Josh Taylor for Jack. So you could say that he was looking past Jack, but I think now you're going to get 100% focused yeah. Josh Taylor on Jack Carroll. Well, of course, and he'd be daft to come in anything different, but he was 100% for, for Jack Catchell. He was 100% for Jack Catchell. He's just got his number, and I believe that Jack's going to do a number on him. And, uh, on May 25th but look if Josh Taylor did it then he gets his big moment of his fuck you moment because he's been taking a lot of stick but he's it. we've caught him in the net Andy and he's fighting on May 25th well I hope he's going to fight on May the 25th he'll be there he'll be there yeah, he he'll be, be there he, he, he has to be otherwise he's going to have to again hang his decorated boots on the old peg well listen I think Josh is still good enough to hang about after this fight and uh, win lose or well, he'll turn up to this one as well come on well, he'll turn up he's turning up yeah, yeah exactly I, I believe so as well I actually believe so I hope so Josh listen let's talk about that £140 division for both men I mean great, even great even division. though this is a right division in boxing at the moment I believe and even though the, there's that bragging rights and rivalry and the hatred and the storyline with these two fighters yeah. there's more to it on the line because if Josh sticks around at 140 He's in a division where he can go on and become a two-time world champion. Jack can come and be world champion as well in a dangerous division with Devin Haney's, Ryan Garcia's. Um, geez, Tank Davis, if he's going to hover about, you've got Sabri Mateus, you've got Liam Paro. It's just, but I, like, it's just listen to division. them names. It's a stacked division, and look, the winner of this fight goes on to mega, mega fights only, and it's very, very exciting. Listen, Jack knows what's, what comes with a win of this fight, and I'm sure Josh does as well. Josh, listen, Josh has won everything there is to win in boxing, but there's a reason Don't why. you forget that? Uh, listen, I don't forget that. Just because you try and outcrep me, listen, I respect Josh and all his achievements. I just think, yeah, I he, ha- I think, he, I think he handled the, the, uh, the defeat win just poorly, which is, a, that, that was my only, that's my gripe. But other than a, but a fighter and what he's achieved, unbelievable. In your heart of hearts, right? Let's, you, you, I know you know it's going to be a tough fight. I know you know that. So in your heart of hearts, the way you see the fight, how does it go down? Jack wins the fight, genuinely. I, I can't, I'm not going to say, oh, he smashes him to be... Jack wins the fight. Jack's a better boxer than Josh Taylor. Wins the fight. I like, I like you, Sam. I really do. And I like Jack Carroll and I like Josh Taylor. This is going to be a very, very shit fight week for me, I think. No, it's not. Listen, Josh is your mate and it's fine because, listen, you're a good guy. You, you give great interviews, but there's no problem with having your friends in boxing. That's your friend in boxing. It's just a shame he's going to get whooped. So I can, I can not sit on the fence on this fight. Is that what you're hoping? Of you, listen, of course, of, course you, of course you don't have to sit on the fence in this fight. That's what. Listen, too many people in boxing are pussies. They don't fucking give their opinions because they're scared of what people think. Predict a fight. It's fine. It's no problem. There has to be a winner and a loser, no, in boxing. 
it's, it's good to give your opinion. I get some fights really right, I get some really wrong, but that's what makes boxing good. Opinions, opinions are great. People shouldn't just like go, oh, oh no, I'm not, I don't know how to, mm. how, just, just let you know your opinion. Yeah, I like that. And I will, what I will say as well, now that Sonny Edwards isn't here, um, now you can see your piece on the Cameron Vong yes. situation against Jordan Flynn. Yeah, just the, 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 the injury and, and not, what was the, the problem there? Cameron's, Cameron's, Cameron's hurt his shoulder and he had a chest infection. He was on antibiotics. Cameron wanted to fight. Me and Jamie Moore told Matchroom he's not fighting on that day. We would like to reschedule it as soon as possible, right? Needs a few weeks, needs a few weeks to recover and we're straight, and we're straight back on. Apologies to Jordan Flynn, apologies. But Jordan Flynn, on the back of it, doesn't have a promotion, promotional deal and he's able to... Earn some money tonight, and then he's earning, earning, um, earning more money on June the twenty second. So, saying, so you're saying to me that fighters do get injuries and fights do get postponed? Absolutely, but not sixty four times like Josh Taylor. So let's not start that. Andrew, knew where I was going with that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, a good, good fight for John Flynn. I think Sonny sort of half alluded to the fact as well that this might be a, 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 a step too far for Cameron too soon. He's a good promoter. Sonny's a good manager. He's been around. He's he's been around a lot, a lot, and he knows what he's saying. He's trying to. He's basically saying, oh, the weights. But ultimately, Jordan's not a small kid. They're, they're, he's, he's in great condition, and it's a it's a big fight for both guys, and it's a, uh, everyone's really looking forward to it. Sam, you've came backstage for a piss, yes, and uh, yes. you've done ten minutes with Sonny, and you've done six minutes with me. Yeah, so, yeah. as always, you later, appreciate you, brother, and I'll see you, I'll see you April twenty seventh. Yeah. I'll probably see you before that, but I'll see you soon. Wall Street memes casino. I'm fine. And sportsbook.